Well, who's this young Targaryen? Hi, my loves. Hey, y'all. I hope you're feeling well today and this week and um, for the past week and beyond. I hope you're taking good care of yourself. We're about to have a little self-care film viewing experience. I'm so excited for the movie this week, y'all. I'm so excited. <laughs> the movie this week is Abigail. Uh, this movie came out this year, 2024. It is still in the theater. I highly encourage you to go see it in the theater. I will be seeing it in the theater. I actually already bought a ticket to see this movie. A matinee ticket. I didn't go see it. I just bought it to support the box office. <laughs> but I will go see it. I am going to buy another ticket and go see it. I do that sometimes when there's a movie that I really want to do well, but I can't get to the theater. <laughs> anyway, yeah, so I'm really excited about this movie, y'all. It is the re- convening of a very successful trio, Radio Silence and Melissa Barrera, the directors who gave us Scream 5 and 6. <sighs> also starring Melissa Barrera. Look, I'm not going to get into the state of the Scream franchise right now. It's devastating. <laughs> I mean, y'all know how much I love the Scream franchise. I really, truly do. And it has been such a happy place for us. And it is not anymore. It's a dark place now. <laughs> Like, I know that some people are still getting joy and excitement from the new film, and I have nothing to say about that. If it's something that you need that's helping you get through life right now, and this is the path that you're taking, then I don't, I don't have anything to say about it, you know? But um, personally, me, myself, I'm disgusted and devastated. And like all of the joy, all the luster, all the goodness has been dragged through the mud, and it's just like a very unjoyous place for me to be right now. I'm sure you're aware if you're a fan of Melissa the franchise, <laughs> if you're just a person in the world, you might be aware of what happened with the criminals that run Spyglass and the firing of this actress, the maligning of her character that followed as well. But yeah, it's just uh, ridiculous. And it's not just callous and unjust, but it's <sighs> indicative of the larger, more sinister nature of our world, which continually prizes material expansion over human life. It's devastating, y'all. Please, this world will drag you down if you let it. So take care of yourself. I'm gonna get, I'm gonna leave the pulpit right now. I'll leave some links if you would like to in some way mitigate some of those horrors. And other than that, y'all, I am just really turning on my my joy factor and really excited to watch this movie. It's a vampire tale about a little girl. That's all I know. I haven't watched any trailers, y'all know me, but um, I'm here by the strength of the names involved and the premise alone. Look at that pointed toe. A ballet artiste. Cue the Tchaikovsky. <laughs> Love that for her. Matilda! I did not realize that it's the little girl from the musical version of Matilda. She's phenomenal. She's fantastic. She was so good in that movie. I've seen it twice. I cried both times very hard. <laughs> your little ballet practice. Oh, we're heisting a child? Mm, we're kidnappers? <laughs> really hot kidnappers? This I is like, like a criminal. Got a boyfriend or something like that. Get serious. We're here to kidnap. <laughs> like, is this the time? <laughs> Rock star. 
you're not good at crime. <laughs> like, this is not the time for that. Front door is clear. Oh, that's the problem with a smart house. <laughs> Somebody can just into your home. Whoa. Tiny dancer is arriving. No one said it was a kid. No one said that. It's a fucking kid. You want to walk? Oh. Walk. She didn't know she was kidnapping? Yeah, that's what I thought. Get a position. You, over there. Are you here to kidnap them? This is dark. This is fucked yeah. up. Why are you gonna traumatize a little girl? You can sense them. Yeah, it's fine. Okay. Bye. <laughs> dark. Good, good, good job. <laughs> Sorry, but get the Matilda. Abigail. <laughs> Punch a little girl? A little ballerina girl? <sighs> if you had that sedation, why didn't you just do it quick and quiet? Why'd you have to terrify the shit out of her? Could be the father. That's not part of the plan. Oh, you only plan to harass a child? <laughs> oh! Oh, that's disgusting. Ten seconds that he had to do one. Should I take the shot? We'll be out at nine. This is... Abigail. And you plan to what? Hold her for ransom? Right, I think we're in the clear. <laughs> Y'all deserve whatever you get. <laughs> Even if the father is a terrorist, why involve the little girl? Don't tend his wound. <laughs> He's a kidnapper. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Grabbing like that again, I may have to respond. Okay, there's cameras at this intersection. Did you hear me? Yeah. Why are you driving like that? Not bad. What's your name anyway? He's not professional. He's trying to hit. About to get real accelerated in this bitch. You did that shit, y'all. Girl, you must be in the trenches, and they must be paying big money, cause. Another wealthy location? Who are these? Who gonna be living in here? Ooh. Ooh. Run down, dilapidated. It's like the flip side of where you just left. <gasps> Damn! They had money for real, for real. Tian Carmo. Me, good time. Whose house is this? This place is pretty sweet. What's your whole situation? Yeah, <laughs> What's that? Yeah, get the girl situated. Meet back here in five. Can you? For those of you who don't know, I go by Lambert. So all came highly recommended. And so far, those recommendations are paying off. Ugh. Uh, no real names, no backstories, and keep the grab ass to a minimum. It's a 24 hour job. Now, you babysit. But the only one that sees the girl is this one. So she only hears one voice. Who's the girl? You don't need to know her name. I don't care about her name. Whose kid is she? The fuck's that matter to you? A very wealthy man who's about to be $50 million poorer. Oh, so it's the ransom situation. Look, you're safe here. I'm going to collect your cell phones. In the bag. I'll take edge dice on this real quick. Thank you. Just, okay. What the fuck? <laughs> you're at a $50 million kidnapping, girl. Oh, <laughs> you have a child too? I hope you can see she's a liability. <laughs> she's already decided to be on Abigail's side. Isolated. How come we can't use our real name? What names? Fine. Frank, Dean, Sammy, Peter, Joey, and you're Don fucking Rickles. Who the fuck is Don Rickles, man? There's clean bedding and lit fires in the rooms. Kitchen's fully stocked, so is the bar. See you in 24 hours. 
my lovely pack of rats. How does she get vampired? Or is one of y'all the vampire? No, she's the vampire. Right, this place is dope, right? Can I have a drink with us, Joey? Gotta go check on the kids soon. No party poopers allowed anyway. <laughs> hey, who do you best seek that this girl's father is? Some tech billionaire. Uh, you don't get a house like that without being in some shit. Weapons, drugs, human trafficking. Probably. What about you, Joey? Let me get a piece of that candy. Get your own. Fuck you too. <laughs> you grew up with a bunch of brothers and sisters, huh? I'm like an expert at reading people. You might be the least perceptive person I've ever met. Chris, one hundred dollar bill. You can tell me one true thing about me. Pass. Mm -hmm. Told y'all she ain't no shit. He used to be a cop. It's the stance, the walk, the shoes. Not to mention the standard issue Glock, the shoulder holster, and he used police hand signals. Not a street cop. Uh oh. You need to be in control. Ooh. <laughs> so I'm gonna say detective. Homicide or vice? Any Looking like vice. He's from Queens. Probably only been up here a few years. Damn. Hey, uh, you do me too? You basically got a fucking neon sign over your head that reads muscle. Quebec, Okay. Right? <laughs> you got bullied in school? Probably by dad too. Oh. So when oh. you're bigger than everyone else, you turn the tables. How much will this get me? A 20? That's cheap, considering you come from money. It's true. Which means you're only- <laughs> She's excited! Use a keyboard instead of a gun and tell yourself that makes what you do not as bad. Ooh. Good luck when the illusion wears off. The library is open. I would not like this. Don't read me. <laughs> no cash. Yeah, I don't want to know what you think, what you know. <laughs> I'll just leave it at Semper Fi. And you're getting off easy. Uh-oh. Are y'all going to fool? Because <laughs> it's looking well, real like you might. You don't want me to do you. What do you mean? It's fun. You're not a professional. You've got loose wiring. <laughs> Probably a sociopath. Uh-oh. <laughs> and you are a junkie. Damn. Cotton knows a junkie. Candy affectation. You in recovery or something? How many days you got? You gonna be worried about you? No. No? Don't ever fuck with me. What do you mean? Back the hell up. I will know. I'm gonna go check on the girl. <laughs> I you know it. To be Junkies bad. never share candy. Junkie hurts too, must you? <laughs> How are you feeling? I wanna go home. Me too, but we can't just yet. Hopefully very soon. Can you take the blindfold off? It's really tight. Are the cuffs hurting you? Yeah, I'm just sort of... Um... <laughs> well, <laughs> whatever happens, y'all did bring it on yourselves. Do you know who my father is? No, and we don't want to know, so don't tell me. Can you promise me you're not gonna let anybody hurt me? I'll do you one better. I pinky promise you mm -hmm. that I'm not gonna let anyone hurt you. Cute. I mean, you're her kidnapper, so it's fucked up, but it's still Look cute. Oh, you can call me Joey. Do you have any kids? Should you? A little boy? It looks like. I have a little boy. What's his name? Mine's Abigail. I can't tell you his name. I'm just gonna call him Justin. What's Justin like? Is she running game? Is she trying to manipulate you? Just a normal kid. What does he like? Just normal kid stuff. Do you not know? I really know about kid stuff. You live for the stage. Well, he thought he wanted a child, but then he just lost interest. Yeah, he must be evil. If he has $50 million dollars to spare. <laughs> he doesn't care about me. Mm. He probably doesn't care about anything but money, honey. Being a billionaire is a moral failure. <laughs> I'll be back soon. Joey? I'm scared. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry about what's gonna happen to you. I'd be sick. <laughs> I would immediately run and tell the others. <laughs> um, what do you mean? Expound, little one. <laughs> I don't need to know who the girl's father is, but do you know? No. Why? She just implied that her father might be a particularly violent man. Well, might not be him. <laughs> she implied that they should run. She's scared. She wants to rattle you. Okay, well, she did. I'm rattled. <laughs> I just don't scare easy, so when I do, I pay attention. She said, my instincts are telling me oh, this is going to go bad for us. Ha! I like you. You're scary, really? though. Scary. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she is so funny to me. Are you lying to me? 
No. You fucking lie to me? No. Don't lie to me. I'm not. What color are my eyes? What color are my eyes? It's what? a simple fucking question, I kid. I can't see your face. Good. Yeah, like, why would Who she... Who the fuck is your father? Joey said you didn't want to know. Well, fuck Joey. I do want to know. Who the fuck is your father? Okay. I'm sorry. What? What? Christoph Lazar. Who who is that? <laughs> also, you weren't supposed to go in the room, so it's your own fault that she saw your fucking face. Yo, what's going on, bag man? I'm leaving. What? You heard me. You cut up my share however you want. You can't just leave without telling us what's going on. That little girl is Christoph Lazar's daughter. Who's Christoph Lazar? Yeah, who? Who's Lazar? Guess who? Urban legend, man. Calm down. No, dude. He's not a fucking urban legend. He is very fucking real, believe me. And how would a little girl know his name otherwise? He controls a lot more than just crime. Is Lambert fucking insane? He just put a death mark on all of us. What if we just, like, you know, like, give her back and say sorry? <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Here's your daughter, Mr. fucking Antichrist. We're really <laughs> sorry. She's traumatized. <laughs> Fuck you, Frank. This isn't the time for sarcasm, okay? Big word for you, baby. <laughs> Let's just leave. We leave her with some food, make an anonymous phone call, get the fuck out of Dodge. I like that. It's not like she's seen our faces. Uh, actually, she has, thanks to you. I was supposed to be the only one in yeah. that room, and I wore my mask. Well, I didn't, so I walk in there to see Angelina Ballerina memorizing my fucking face. Why did you take off her blindfold, Joey? It's messy. Now we have to kill her. There were a lot of bad decisions, we're not just me. Girl. If we just leave her here, then we don't get none of that money. Can you please to touch money. down on Earth? <laughs> How much do you trust Lambert? I trust him enough. Seven million per person isn't worth the risk, then what is? It's a lot of money. Can a dead bitch spend seven million dollars? <laughs> y'all are so foolish. I wouldn't have had his kidnap the kid if he didn't think we could pull this off. So maybe we all just pretend like we don't know who our father is, and with the money we're making from this, we just disappear forever. Hmm? Start a new life and never have to see any of you fucks ever again. Good luck, dum dums. <laughs> any threat is gonna come from outside, so we set a perimeter and we hold it. Rickles takes first watch in the crow's nest. <laughs> Joey, secure the interior. Only two hours. Y'all can't do it. <clears throat> Fuck. If you could, there wouldn't be a movie. <laughs> Surely not Abigail, unless she already slipped her cuffs. Mmm. This. Oh. What a gorgeous, creepy library. What gorgeous, creepy statues. <laughs> Window. I thought I heard someone out here. I'm not as stealthy as I thought. You wanna come in? I sort of have this reputation of being a professional. Hey, listen. What's up with y'all? <laughs> what is that? Whoa, what is that? I don't trust any of these other fucks. But you trust her? So let's watch each other's backs. I was thinking the same thing. Okay, y'all. <laughs> okay. You're not supposed to be doing that. <laughs> Focus. Matilda is planning to do y'all dirty. Dean, it's Dean. I'm sorry. What the fuck? Yeah, what the fuck, dude? It's not funny. You can have it. Yeah. <laughs> Why would I want that? We could just like, you know. Five we were told yeah, not to yeah, fuck. <laughs> like, please. It's a stupid oh, motherfucker! God! I didn't mean to scare you. I don't give a shit! <laughs> Are you sure? Real. Fuck off! Why would I want to be terrorized right before sex? You're a fucking weirdo. Okay. I'm just about to pull out that fanny pack. Girl, why? <laughs> Y'all do a lot of getting fucked up on the job too. You drinking and smoking? Oh. <laughs> what are those dragons leaving the castle? Well, who's this young Targaryen? Yeah, what the fuck? Is the house significant in some way? 
it seems like nobody lives here, but there's a bowl of onions in this this kitchen. <laughs> He is very dumb, so I do feel like he'll die first, but is it too soon? I don't know. What is this room? What the fuck? You just squared up on a rat. <laughs> Actually, I kind of identify. Fuck this shit. Oh. What, 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 what? Possible for you to brush through that hair? Just curious. It's not a read. Hey! I agree. Give up. <laughs> like no need for you to die. Down here with his missing ass. Oh. Just run. There was no blood. <laughs> was to catch it that's insane <laughs> that's crazy that her reflex was to catch, <laughs> to catch the hand <laughs> i definitely would have backed up <laughs> clearly he was decapitated girl i don't know there's a dick on your face <laughs> Behead him if that's what you're saying. What does that look like to you? It looks like a fucking wild animal ripped him apart. Yeah. <laughs> Stories about Lazar's hitman. Can we not do this, please? Valdez. Real Lazar's top guys got pinched a few years ago. The FBI flipped him. The night before the trial, they were all hauled up on the top floor of a hotel. Next morning, the FBI goes into the room. All their bodies are ripped apart. Oh. Limbs and organs missing. That's his signature. Valdez. Now, there was no way in and out of that room except for the front door of the 23rd story window. What happens to the organs? That's not the first time I heard that story. Better check on the girl. All right, let's get this out. <laughs> Valdez or anyone else is in here. I also would want him close. I don't know why that. Lambert is a meticulous motherfucker. He's very, very careful. If he gave us up, that means either one of us did it, or Valdez is in here. Or one of us is Valdez. What? How does that I make you? Like to be so to cut an idea. Yeah, I mean, if heads are being ripped off of bodies, cool. unbeknownst to us, I think it's time to go. <laughs> you welcome to my share, Pete. You could be the richest, headless man in America. Right. <laughs> Thank you. Dead bitches don't spend money, y'all. Dead bitches don't buy yachts. Just because she's still in there doesn't mean that Valdez is not here. I'm out. You coming? Suit yourself. Yeah, I mean... You're leaving? Very true to form. <laughs> Yes, we are fleers. For our own life, we will flee. Hey. Remain if you must. It's actually weird that you're staying now, Melissa. <gasps> uh-uh. Trapped like rats. It's already too late. What the fuck? Stand back. You can juggernaut your way through? Okay. Look. Thanks, Peter. Darling. <laughs> Sorry, were you fed? Were you put here to be eaten? Uh, what the fuck is happening? <laughs> okay. This whole thing is a trap. Yeah, what is this place? What is this house? Shit. I'll see what I can find out. Gun's gone. What the fuck? Has anyone besides me and the men with the glasses been in here? <gasps> can you pinky promise me that you're not keeping a secret? Spill it, girl. <laughs> Are you it's gonna hurt me? Who? Oh, the man with the glasses. He told me I had to keep a secret, or he told me. What? Abigail. Is she playing y'all against hey, each other? Cause I don't remember him saying I'm anything. I'm not gonna let him hurt you. You let him come but in I here before with a gun. What he said. He said he works for my father, Valdez. Frank is Valdez. Frank wanted to leave. That doesn't make any sense. 
he acted like he wanted to leave. If he's Valdez and Lazar's his boss, then why kidnap this kid? Right. Maybe he and Lambert are planning a power play. That skinny motherfucker rips people apart. It seems unlikely, but... <laughs> Something doesn't add up. Aside from Frank, these guys are amateurs. You want me, right? Medic. We can take him. We can take him. If it's Frank... Hot. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> take the main staircase where I go south. We meet in the middle. We gonna get through this. I have to. You have a kid. There's kind of like a little romance going on, and I do not hate it. <laughs> ah, I'm interested. I'm intrigued. I don't know. <laughs> I mean, obviously this plan isn't going to work, but I'm like, ooh. <laughs> I'm excited to see it unfold. <laughs> what? Rickles? What? I just, turned, I just turned around. Why are you swaying? Why is it giving bobblehead? Funko Pop. Why are you standing like that? What's going on? Are you, are you choking? Are you, are you gurgling on your own blood? Please don't let his head roll off. Oh, oh! How? Girl, not sight nor sound. <laughs> you are so fucked, all of you. God, what the fuck? <laughs> Where's Frank? Why'd you do it? Do what? Bring us here to kill us. I don't, I don't know. Don't do it, Peter. You guys know what the fuck she's talking about? Uh, I think she thinks that you brought us here to kill us. <laughs> I said what I Fantastic said. Fantastic insight, Peter. <laughs> Y'all know. Can you share know. what's on your mind, Joey? He has no You're wings. Valdez, and you just killed Wrinkles. Mr. Wrinkles is dead? Mr. Wrinkles. <laughs> you let a little girl get inside your head? You're not as smart as you think you are. The girl, though, she's fucking inspired. She is very smart. Like I believe her. Well, I hate to say it, but I think we're gonna have to get rough with her. Don't take another fucking step, Peter. I just want to get to the bottom of this. You know, my team is dropping like flies, and well, our guest has besmirched my good name, and I take that very personally, you know? I'm very sorry, okay? Oh. Oh. Joey, what's happening? Just <laughs> throwing something out. <laughs> I'm handling it, baby. <laughs> what is he talking about? Shut up. She's not gonna kill me. I might be wrong, Frank. <laughs> Around here. I'm Miss Joey. I'm doing my best here, Abigail. Please put that somewhere else. Down. Look at. She said, "I'm done playing the." Did you just? Are you, are you breaking your little bones? Sammy, shut the fuck up. What the fuck did she get out of those cuffs? Shot. Oh my god, look at the double, the teeth on top of the teeth. <laughs> Stop. Oh. I wouldn't have shot her. I wouldn't have shot her. We already saw that didn't work. I don't want to piss her off anymore. <laughs> like, I'm still on your side, Abigail. Yeah, let's get them. <laughs> you can't have a fucking vampire. <laughs> I feel sick. At least Valdez isn't in here. Fucking girl is Valdez, you yeah. moron. God. I thought her name was Abigail. Baby. Jesus, no, Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> we gotta get out of here. There's gotta be another way. No, I checked all the other doors. This is some kind of magnetically sealed locks and these shutters are two inches thick. What do we know about vampires? That they're not real. We know they feed off blood. We're really doing yes. this right now. They can turn other people into vampires. They can turn into bats and stuff like that. Mind control and make you do shit. They don't have a reflection. Not listening to this. Okay. <laughs> But you already saw it with your very own eyes. Safe through the heart. Crucifixes. Holy water. Oh, you're fucking priest now? Daylight is a big one. Oh, 3.30 in the fucking morning. Shut up. Shut the fuck up. Dum dum. We got a real fucking situation here. So what are you think? Let's not do that again. Right, like he could... It's because she like a little girl. There's pool cues in the game. Go sharpen them into stakes. <laughs> That's a good idea, actually. Range weapon. <laughs> you say we tool up and we kill her. Killing her would be the stupidest thing we could do. We lose the only bargaining chip we have. We trade her to Lazar for our lives. No, I'm not betting our lives on your fucking hunch. I'm telling you, she's gonna see you coming. No, debate is over. Decision made, okay? I got him! Sammy, those are onions. Those are fucking onions. Girl. I don't cook, I don't know. All right. I'm you don't so eat either? Fucking vampire. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
I'm not going. I already told you why. Yeah. I don't see how throwing cloves of garlic at her is gonna be any better though. Why did you snap the pool cues in half? I would have wanted a full cue to myself, like distance between me and the vampire. Yeah, right. Is she gonna swan like y'all to the afterlife? Oh! She's ballroom dancing with a corpse. her super vampire hearing and is this house connected to them because why did she have her own little ballet studio in here right i do not want to run into her <laughs> for all y'all know this could be like a training ground for her <laughs> you were set up for fodder you're just here to like keep her killer instincts sharp now why would she hide? Y'all are the ones that can't do shit. Oh! Oh god, oh god, oh god. I'm actually gonna be sick. It is, it, it is, it is. They set people up, they they get people to kidnap her, and then she kills them all, right? Because what the fuck? Peter! I got a splinter on my finger, a huge one! How many bodies are talking? Like two, three? Sixty? Peter. Yeah, 
run away. <laughs> things. Abby, let's talk. We want to talk. Thank <laughs> you gagged us good, girl. Please let me out. Gladly. If. You're really good at pretending to be a little girl. Thank you. Ah. Centuries of experience. Cent Tell us how to get out of here and we'll let you go. Hey, what's going to happen to me? Am I gonna turn into a vampire? Maybe. Oh, oh, oh. oh my god! You said baby! <laughs> I don't Ma'am, whatever. <laughs> I'm sorry. We thought you were just a regular 12 year old girl. You were gonna beat me and torture me. Yeah. When you thought I was just a regular 12 year old girl. Yeah, well. Very thought. Like I say, we're very sorry. <laughs> you would never have taken Speeding you from who your father was. You did work for him, didn't you? So that part wasn't Haven't a Haven't you wondered why I brought you all here? I planned all of this. Lambert works for me. What are you talking about? Don't you know, Jesse? Oh, government name. You started your career siphoning money. Hedge funds came next. And eventually, much bigger fish. I can give it back. Terrence Lacroix, muscle for the Montreal Broussard family. Did it bore you? Snapping necks for pay. Damn. And your endless taunts from your colleagues about your stunted intellect. Mm -hmm. Is that why you stole from your crew? A tiny subsidiary of our empire? How long did the money last? You weak, disloyal, inebriate. Damn. Former detective Adam Barry thought you could infiltrate our New York arm. But you liked the life a little too much, didn't you? Uh-oh. The power you had when you were free of rules and regulations. Sounds like a cop. It became an addiction. Hmm? When you finally arrested our three lieutenants, you'd worked so hard to get close to. How empty did you feel after I ripped up their bodies in the hotel penthouse? You left town and you never saw your family again. Damn. But it wasn't for their safety. Why was it then? He just abandoned them? Finally. The tragic Anna Lucia Cruz, Ooh, former Anna army Lucia. medic, shooting up Uncle Sam's morphine. I was injured in the field. You tried to take care of your son mm -hmm. before abandoning him to his fuck up of a father. Uh. You became an underground doctor for some very shady people. Damn. But one day, you were just too high to do your job. And instead of removing a bullet, you nicked an artery. Damn. And someone very. Important to my father's business split out. This is punishment. What do you tell yourself, huh? You want to be your daddy's little errand girl? Who's the daddy? Is he also a vampire? How many of your father's enemies do you think you're gonna have to kill until he loves you again? This is just a game to her. Bullshit. She was screaming at the house, and dad triggered the alarm. That wasn't even her father. And for what? Because you're fucking bored? I like playing with my food. You're the same as all the other meat sacks I've brought here over the years. Ugh. Who's inside a cage right now? Girl, temporary. If you let me out, I'll let two of you live. Which two? <laughs> <laughs> he 
fucking lying, moron. You touch that door, you're as dead as the rest of us. Why would she Maybe like it's worse No matter how many of you I kill, my father doesn't love me, and he's not going to trade anything for me. So go on, Peter. Let me out. Peter, if you touch that door, I will shoot you. I'm sorry, guys. Why are you doing this? <laughs> I don't think you should do this. I just told you to your motherfucking face that I was going to shoot you. Sammy, watch her. Talk that shit. Sammy, I'm not staying down here with that. That's fair. I got this. What if she's just pretending she can't get out of there? I mean, this bitch can fly. Open the door and I'll let you keep all your blood. Organs too. Tell me how to get the fuck out of here, and I'll consider it. You have to let me out immediately after I do. Okay, fine. <laughs> All right. There's a secret door in the library. The bookshelf on the right wall, and then there were none. Very good. Thanks. A deal's a deal. All right, the deal. You impaled his thigh. He is not gonna open that door. Ain't I a silly Billy? Still gullible at your age? You fucking freak. She's just gonna snatch you. Why are you talking shit so close? What's so fucking funny? <laughs> I would be so insulted by the Swan Lake performance in the midst of my death. Does fuck her up. Her man exploded. Will it grow back like a lizard? Ew, it is. Well, this is good. This is good. We have a chance. She's scared to walk in. You didn't turn yet. Stip a finger in. Saved your motherfucking life, so maybe you should. And then there were none. Okay. It did nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Embarrassing. Very. Fucking yes, fucking vampire. Are you good? <laughs> you had to try. Grab something. We're gonna break through this wall. Break into where? You can't get through. Oh, you fainting? Oh, run out of candy. Oh, you just wanted to sit near me, sisterhood, or something else. At least we have each other. Second chance romance. <laughs> Is that true? What she said about your son? It seems very true. Yeah, when I got clean, I was gonna go back for him. That was his the plan. That's good. That's why you need help. I get to talk to him. That's why I took this job with that money. I can start over. Ooh, fucking bullshit. Oh. It's not about the money. The money's an excuse. Then go back to your kid because he's scared of being a piece of shit mother. That's true. God, everybody's gotta be a fucking victim now. Oh, <laughs> I was on drugs. Oh, I was on drugs because I got hurt. Own your fucking shit and go and be a mother to that kid. He's not wrong. Like it, her situation is still difficult and real and true, but what also what he said is true. <laughs> if I can find the power source, then we can just short it. What, are you gonna unplug the fucking house? Okay, we search the house. Two teams. Well, who's going with Twilight here? <laughs> I'm going with you. Fucking dream team. <laughs> okay, well. Stay alert. She's toying with us. There's nothing here. You got any other bright ideas? No Nosferatu? This isn't gonna work. This is so fucking stupid. Oh, Sorry. what's this Listen room? I'm gonna go find that power source. I'm gonna get the fuck out of here. You think so? Yes. I don't think so, but it would yes. be nice. You're my friend. Okay. He just revealed himself to be very sweet, so I feel like his death is imminent. <laughs> uh oh. Y'all finna get act two. Oh, are you starting to thirst for blood? She's turning. 
She turned? You can be compelled by your sire. That is so fucking cool. Very unfortunate for you though. She's quick and deadly. Drink the blood though. You just ripped the flesh. Peter, you drank too much. Three, three, seven, seven, here. <laughs> she looks good though. She looks really good. I guess you did drink the blood. She's drinking all the blood. <laughs> Are you a dancer now too? Voodoo vampire. <laughs> Abigail is kind of an icon. It's very unfortunate. <laughs> Choreograph this. Is this original? <laughs> oh, a little Jojo Siwa. <laughs> Not good at the faking. Oh no. You're not good at pretending Brad, to be Sammy. Shh. She's still in here. <laughs> the way you licked your 87 Thank teeth. You. Oh, nasty. Run. What? Run. <laughs> Two against one. And I say one because we know that he's done for. Hated this room. It's the two vampires against Joey. Ana Lucia. Whoa! Oh Great vampire deaths. Very true blood in the way they explode. But less nasty because it's not like all stringy gunk. Now what do we do about the real fucking problem? Oh. Not that, right? Not that. <laughs> we don't know. We don't know anything about that. <laughs> Girl, you look so good, covered in blood. <laughs> Terrible to say, but it's real. She filmed what? She filmed y'all earlier. Position to negotiate, baby doll. You fucking set me up. Abigail turned me two years ago. She found out I helped you in New York. Ooh. Now all I do is bring her father's enemies here. Yaki, your life is pathetic. Done. Can you, you fight can her? You die here, or you can help me kill Abigail. She can help control you. you. How am I supposed to help you? We don't need a little upgrade. Fucking puppet like Sammy. Fuck no. No, you'd be just like me. You get the complete truth. I told Lazar there's a problem. He's on his way. We'll kill the girl. We'll kill her father. And we'll take over the whole fucking thing. This is crazy. drink from the sire then you're like real real but if you yeah. just get a bite you turn into a little voodoo be one of us. that's yeah. nasty as hell oh it happens fast are you rejecting the turn Ew! oh this is grotesque the noises what's happening inside girl you need to get out of there Run. Oh, he is a fountain of blood. He is just, the entire blood volume is coming out of his mouth. Was that supposed to happen? 
Is that copacetic? Girl, get your sexy ass up off the floor. You're still with us. Um. Frank. I'm an apparition. It's your first victim. I see, this is what I was worried about. So the stent does work if you can get it through the heart. It's here on my side. That's for setting me up, you undead prick. The way that everybody gets their fucking own great. individual nasty fucking set of teeth. <laughs> no two teeth have the same teeth. Great okay. world building. <laughs> I told you not to fuck with me. I never fuck with you not once. You better fucking run. Why? So you found Lambert. Did he try to convince you to take it all before you killed him? <laughs> When you're already a vampire. When you're the sire of the sire. That's your grandsire. <laughs> oh, good job, Joey, on a Lucia. <laughs> yeah, don't wait in there with them, Joey, on a. Like, this is not your problem. Is he drinking her drink? Yeah. Girl, you look so good. <laughs> why is that like that? Like, why? Why? Oh, no. Philistine. The least awful thing she did was be a ballerina. <laughs> who, you, who you calling? Hello? Oh, your son. Hey Caleb. It's mom. Gotcha. Uh -huh. Can't come to the phone right now, mm. but the message. I love you so much. You're the one good thing I did in life. Oh wow. She is really preparing for and the I end. I just needed you to hear that. Don't make him listen to you die. Hang up, hang up now. It's a little late to be a good mom now. That's you? not what she was trying to do. You fucking junkie. Say junkie again. I'm fucking kill you, Frank. I know you do, girl. Oh. It's like a reverse of what you got in Scream when you fell from the balcony. You got thrown up. Oh my god, don't throw me back down. Oh. side with Abigail in a heartbeat. If you want to kill me, you have to drain me. Oh. <laughs> she said feather time is over, bitch. <laughs> Give you the true tea of how to kill her. So maybe it's not what we think. 
She's been so clever this whole time. I don't think that's it. I think it's time to play my game. Frank says, pick it up. What's happening? But it's not like what happened with Sammy. This is something else. She just doing that little scoot in fear for funsies, her reaction. <laughs> oh, see, you still have it. Oh, I got to watch her get slammed in a Walmart goddamn thing. Get her, Abby. <laughs> no, she's not. Well, what did he make her? Because he bit her all right. Yeah, get them teeth. John Wick him. <laughs> Punch your hand. Vampire takes a long fucking time to learn how to do all the cruel shit. It's very good. It's real good. Oh my god, so much blood. A little entrail. The house is very fucked. Thank you. Oh, your teeth are back. Yeah, thank you, honestly. <laughs> Thanks for picking me to be on your side. <laughs> Please don't kill me. What about this? What about my beat? <laughs> is this is this bad? Is this am I done for? You're fine. Vampire? You're fine. Now that he's dead. Oh. I think I'm gonna I think I'm gonna Yeah. <laughs> I'll call an Uber or something. Don't worry about me. Are you, can you get home? Okay, I'm. You're fine, right? This is. I hope you get Justin back. It's Caleb. I know. Oh. For what it's worth, you just have to show up. Okay, girl. Do you want to be friends? Like, I could use some powerful friends. <laughs> Father. What? 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 Matthew, good. You're so pale. I've gone by many names. Okay. Please don't fuck me up. Please stop. She saved my life. She was here when you weren't. I came when you needed me. What's y'all's relationship like? Like, how did you even get this little girl? Is she your birth daughter and you changed her? You turned her? Joanna, you need to just slide in the gunk out the front door. This is a family feud. This is a dispute that has nothing to do with me. Keep it, sorry. Not to insult. I think you should leave. Gladly. I will head for the motherfucking hills. The dinner time. Don't worry about me. Okay, I'm gone. You never even saw me, you never met me. Bye! Run, girl! Like, I kind of want to keep you. I kind of want to also never lay eyes on you again. <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah, that was crazy as shit. You look really hot, though. Like, there are worse things than surviving. <laughs> you did get the shit beat out of you, though. Never whisper a word of this. I don't give a fuck. This is none of my business. <laughs> oh! Y'all, I actually did not know he passed because I know he's on Euphoria, but I've never watched that show before. I'm so used to him. He was lovely in this. <laughs> I already know that kind of shit is made exactly for me. I love it. I love the Radio Silence vibe. I love the dark woodwork. <laughs> I love the elements of mysticism. I love the gorgeous women drenched in blood. Like, it just is so good. Uh, I'm gonna watch it a million more times. I love it. And I know they also did Ready or Not. Um, Y'all have suggested Ready or Not a lot of times. I have seen that movie. I saw it around the time when it came out. But um, yeah, if y'all are like dying to watch it, we can rewatch it. Even though I feel like the great fun of that movie is the gag. And I already know the gag, but I still, I haven't seen it since I saw it for the first time. So I would definitely rewatch it if y'all want to see it. 
I hope y'all loved Abigail. I loved it. Um, little Matilda, like, I don't want to say a little girl is but she is. Like, <laughs> she is though. Like, it's kind of given mother, even though she's a child. I loved it. Such a good time. <laughs> y'all ate. Melissa ate, as always. I love y'all. I'll see you soon.